Well, now to your health. We've always heard a healthy diet will improve our health. Well, now scientists are wondering whether or not focusing on your gut health can help prevent major diseases. In particular, focusing on improving your gut microbiome that could decrease your risk of cancer. Health reporter Haley Hernandez is here now with more. Haley. Good morning, guys. So I attended an event with national and local leaders on cancer. And while discussing some of the biggest efforts to prevent the devastating disease, gut health became a topic of importance. The gut microbiome is a buzzword in health. Every kind of disease that can be studied is being looked at within the cellular level of the intestinal tract. What could we discover about cancer in the gut? It turns out that gut microbiome does a number of things that can affect cancer directly as well as indirectly. And directly is the direct effects on a cancer cell itself. And what we know is the way the microbes work is we, when we eat, we eat for two, right? We eat for ourselves, we also eat for our bugs, which that's not our intention, but that's what ends up happening. And so the kind of microbes we harbor is a function of what we eat and who we are. Dr. Pavan Reddy says we need to better understand the link between the microbiome and our immune system, which may also reveal how the gut can be manipulated to treat cancer or answer why cancer behaves differently differently in everyone affected. The, the data still needs to come out. I mean, we are just scratching the surface. I mean, I, what I'd like to emphasize is the complexity. I think it might be fascinating to know we harbor more microbes than our own cells. In the meantime, there's one thing you have the power to do to improve the gut microbiome. Eating is what you can control, what you eat, and I mean the old stuff like eat vegetables and you know eat healthy, minimize at least some types of red meat, and all of that holds true. Now we understand some of that is because again the way the microbes break this food down when it goes into our um, into our gut. And of course, all around wellness with your diet, good sleep, low stress, all of that can lower your cancer risk. In the meantime, experts are examining all the ways to manipulate the gut microbiome and improve all kinds of conditions and therefore possibly make the treatments for those diseases more effective as well. Wow, that is fascinating. Yeah, there's a more lot and more. to be learned. Yes, yes exactly. So much to go. Thanks, Haley. Appreciate it.